My name is Chintaka Veerasinghe. I am the uh, operations manager in the Sri Lanka Wildlife Conservation Society. We started work in uh, mitigation of human and wildlife issues. After 1971, the government started huge development plan with the Victoria Dam and sent that water to agriculture purposes for the dry zone of Sri Lanka. The consequences of these agriculture practices, the human-elephant conflict began. 2022, we lost 437 elephants and near 200 people. 100 years ago, 30,000 elephant population in Sri Lanka. But today, we are talking about 6,500 to 7,500 elephant population. This giant animal is endangered situation in Sri Lanka today. So they eat grasses every day and they go to the farmer's home to eat the desert. So the elephants come and uh, raid their crop as well as damage their property. And at night, they have to guard their crop. And we introduced them a new crop variety called the citrus, the oranges. Elephants don't like oranges. This discovered by farmers many, many years ago in Sri Lanka. Uh, it's giving a natural barrier. The perfume of the orange is more strong than other food smell. So every year we are donating 20,000 orange plants to the community here. But the thing is, they need the additional help. We take volunteers to the farmer's land and together we help this poor farmer to uh, plant oranges, harvesting oranges and maintaining their crops uh, the, the orange crop gives them a lot of benefits. We need more volunteers to come into Sri Lanka Wildlife Conservation Society. We have a plan to mitigate human-elephant conflict via orange cultivation. We can contribute our time and effort and experience and everything, our money and everything, to uh, conserve this mega animal in, in this country.